My father is known as the leading figurative artist of his time. On May 25, 2010, he passed away, but his art lives on forever. My father grew up in post-World War II Italy, southern Italy, Bari. And at 18 years old, he moved to Milan to start working and to start sending money down to his family. At a very early age, himself and the rest of the family knew that he had a talent. In 1980, my father started working with all the major publishing companies in Manhattan. Bantam Books, Harlequin, Doubleday Zebra, all of them. He was known as the top illustrator. He created an entire genre. The book covers that you see on the romance novels and the historical novels. Pino was the one who created that entire concept of creating a storyboard and depicting the entire story, the main characters and the scenes, and just putting it on a storyboard and then having the publishers create a wraparound cover. When my father retired from creating uh, these, of course, illustrious book covers, he wanted to paint fine art. He wanted to paint for himself. And a lot of people in the industry would tell me, hey, Max, there was an artist by the name of Norman Rockwell, and he's considered the top leading American illustrator of our time. And then he would say, you know, Norman Rockwell was the first great American illustrator, and your dad was the last great American illustrator. Because after Pino, it all went digital. All these publishing companies started hiring graphic directors and graphic designers and creating all these book covers. So my father was the last great illustrator that painted by hand oil on board. This is what we call the studio. This is where my father painted for over 30 years. And it became a shrine. Upon his passing, we have not touched anything. The way he left it is the way it stands today. As you can see, down to the palette and all the colors and all the brushes that he left by the easel. He ended up being the most popular artist of his time. I mean, hands down, the past 20 years, I don't think there are many artists that, is, that have had so much success worldwide. Mm -hmm. 